I'm Dr. Roger, and this question is from the March 2021 U.S. SAT non-calculator section. College Board is asking us to interpret a linear equation, in particular for h equals 150 plus 10t. They're asking how many housing units are added to the community each month after a zoning law is passed, which is the time period in which this applies. What they're asking here for is the slope, which is 10, if you recognize that the increase per month is the slope. Y equals mx plus b, in this case m is 10 because it's the value multiplied by our variable. If we don't recognize that, we can look that at h of 0, the number of housing units 0 months after the law is passed is 150 plus 10 times 0, which is 150, and h of 1 the number one month after it's passed is 150 plus 10 times 1, which is 150 plus 10 is 160. So the difference is 160 minus 150 is 10 housing units added in the first month, and they're asking how many housing units are added each month. That would be 10, choice A. College Board will always ask you to interpret the slope of a linear equation or the intercept or both in context. So make sure that you can convert between the linear equation and its meaning in the context of a problem. And come back soon for my next video. With math, there's always more.